It has been a rough ride, to say the least, in terms of the economy this year, especially for small businesses. Oregon has been tracking the U.S. Uh, pretty closely through the crisis. So we, we really dropped off a cliff as a country, as a state in the Portland region, pretty equally February, March, April. State economist Christian Kaler says while the country saw a big drop in the economy, we picked back up in the summer especially here in Oregon and Southwest Washington. We saw a little bit of growth in May and then just boom, just a rocket ship up uh, the May, June numbers, both locally here in the Portland region, including Southwest Washington uh, and nationally. A big reason for the skyrocketing growth came from the country slowly reopening. And that meant for the sector that took the biggest hit, the restaurant industry. Kaler is expecting the growth businesses we're seeing in the summer here locally will start to fade heading into winter. So restaurants and businesses that have been struggling through the summer, uh, early fall, are now starting to reevaluate. So, you know, if, if, this is, if this is the economic world I'm, I'm gonna be living in, I need to make some longer term changes. It hasn't been just small businesses trying to adapt. Nike announced earlier this week they were laying off 700 employees at their headquarters in Beaverton. Hiro Itro, an economic professor at Portland State University, doesn't expect things to get easier the next couple of months for businesses both big and small. You know, we are experiencing a lot of ups and downs in the stock market. So the stock market prices have been very volatile. In this kind of situation, it's very difficult for companies to plan investment. The latest economic report comes out this Friday for October, which will shed more light and what some believe will be the start of another drop in numbers. Joe Ranieri, KGW News.